This video shows how to use the basic report elements and to design a report in Report Sharpshooter. This report contains a list of customers with addresses, contact person, and a phone number. Different styles are applied to the even and odd rows to make it easier to view the report. Start New Project in Microsoft Visual Studio, Windows Forms Application. Set Project Name to Style. Place Dataset Element onto the form by double-clicking on the Dataset Element on the toolbox. Select Untype Dataset and click OK. Select the Dataset 1 element. Select Table Property and press the button to run Property Editor. Click Add in order to add a table and set Table Name Property to Customers. Select the Columns property and run the Property Editor. Click Add in order to add a new column. There will be four of them. Set Column Name property to Company Name, Address, Contact Name, Phone. Select the form and go to the Load Event Handler to fill data source. Write the following code stating all the required information. Get back to the application form. Add Report Manager component to the form. Report Manager is designed to store report templates collection and data sources. Select the added component. Initialize the owner form property of the Report Manager by selecting the form it's located on. Now double-click Report Manager component to run its editor. Go to the Data Sources tab, press Add button, set data source name to customers and set data source value to dataset customers. Go to the reports tab, click add and select inline report slot in the drop down menu. Set report name to style. Click run designer to run report template designer. Create a new blank report. Press template property button on the toolbar. Set script language to C Sharp. Press Data Band button in the toolbox and add Data Band to the template. Set Data Source to Customers. Press the button on the toolbar to open Style Sheet Editor. Press the plus or add button to add a new style. Set name to even line. Select Fill Property. Click the button to open Fill Editor. Select Solid Fill. Choose a color. Do the same actions with Text Fill property. Add one more style. Set name to Odd Line. Set Fill and Text Fill properties different from the Even Line. Click Detail button on the toolbox and add detail to the template. Click Bindings button on the Properties tab. Open Script Editor for style name and write the following code to set the binding.
Go to the Data Sources tab. Drag and drop a field company name. As a result, text box will be created and script uploading data from the data source will be added to the value property. The same for the rest of the fields. Address, contact name, phone. Save Report Template and Close Report Designer. Add the code to display report to the class constructor. Write Render Completed Event Handler of the Inline Report Slot object. Drag and drop button element from the toolbox on the form. Set button's text property on the property grid to template for the first button. And report for the second one. Double click on the template button on the form to create an event handler for it. Create an event handler for another button. Debug the project to review the result. The template button opens template with the report designer. The report button opens generated final document. 